when I started dunking, it was just maybe I can do this and then sent me on this journey that changed my life for the next 10 years. Came for the dunks and you stayed for the energy. That's your two legs, he got rockets, yes. Everyone should attempt to dunk. Not only can everyone dunk, everyone should dunk. Dunking was a dream, a childhood dream, a not even a 1% possibility. When I did it and I started committing to that journey, it pulled me through the stratosphere of what I thought was possible that I want everyone to go for it. So it started with my body. I learned about my nutrition, eating on a diet, counting calories, to mastering my sleep, which turned out to be one of the most transformative habits of my life. It got me in the best shape of my life. I was the strongest, the leanest, and I could literally fly. It, it really felt like I was able to do anything with my body. Down the line, yes, I did kind of punish my body in a place where I'm not as mobile as I'd like to be, but it showed me what my body is capable of. I used to think that genetics was one of my excuses, and then I realized that's the laziest excuse because there's nobody that can prove it besides you. So simply put, it transformed my physical body. So it transformed my mind. It helped me become more mindful because I started to notice the thought patterns of what I was doubting. I started to notice when I was trying to rush gains. I was trying to achieve something because someone said something or I committed to a goal. It made me more mindful. It heightened my awareness. It led to deeper awarenesses like imposter syndrome. Who am I to be able to dunk at this height? Who am I to think I'm a legit dunker? I was able to do trick dunks and windmills and even between the legs before I could dribble dunk simply because of this imposter syndrome of I don't feel legitimate enough to be the person that can do this. So the ones that made me feel like more a legit dunker, I had a harder time achieving. And that led to my business when I was freelancing and charging money for an entrepreneurial passion. Who am I to charge money for this passion? Who am I who hasn't had formal education in photography or videography to charge this much money? Then I was able to flip that and say, I have this passion. This is better than someone's got formal education. I have a different eye. I have a different style. And I just started to notice this mindset that was holding me back. I was able to see these limiting beliefs and go through them with this dream of dunking. The spirit, the energy. The way dunking felt, the excitement of the possibility of achieving this goal, like I said, possibility, was so overwhelmingly exciting and it was in my grasp that it pulled me through all these things. So I didn't care about anything else. I went to sleep at 9 p.m. despite what other people wanted to do. I didn't care about drinking. I didn't care about going out. I didn't care about relationships. I just wanted to do what's best for my dunk life. Of course, I did those things, but it was way easier to stay on what I wanted to do. It was way easier to do what I wanted to do because of this goal. It didn't feel like I had to force motivation. It didn't feel like I had to find purpose to do it. I was so excited, I wanted to be dialed in to the max. So on the outside, I was super strict with nutrition and sleep and healthy habits and doing all these things, going to the gym multiple hours of the day, multiple sessions, two a days, dunking like a maniac. For what? Because I loved the expression. I loved how it felt to push my body to that limit to find that ultimate expression within me. It was lighting me up. It was something I could master. Mastery is something you attempt to go towards and never fully get there because there's always new steps. And that's what led me to this new energy, this new expression, this new thing that makes me come alive, which is rapping. It feels like a mountain on top of another mountain, compounding layers of magic. When I started dunking, it was just, maybe I can do this and then sent me on this journey that changed my life for the next 10 years. It showed me what it feels like to have this inspiration pull you, to have this calling that excites you and lights you up, pull you through all those things that look like they take discipline. It taught me that believing is seeing. If I can believe it within and feel it, I can see it in this reality. I don't need to see something to say, okay, now it's possible. I could say, oh, what if this is possible and feel that jolt and go for it. Mm. So I ask you, what is your dunk life? What is something that's calling you that faint voice? Mine was so faint, I had to go through a 10 year dunk journey just to hear this call of music and performing. So what is calling you? What is that tiny whisper that says, what if this is possible that lights you up? Because that is your connection to source. That is your gift. That is your natural light coming through you saying, that's where I want to go. And it's going to pull you to be your best self. The rapping right now, performing, is helping me be my more authentic self, which feels so freeing. When I perform, when I rap, when I create music, I feel it trickle out into all the other aspects of my life. Now I'm feeling that inspiration again to train the best I can, to be the best leader I can, to be in my most power 
powerful form. And it's exciting and it's fun and it's free. So I hope you find what Dunk Life means to you. Share your voice. What comes to mind first without thinking? What just gets dropped in to your awareness? What is something you don't want to say? Are you afraid to say? Are you afraid to say, I'm a rapper or I'm a dancer or I want to be an author? What are these big dreams that you're afraid to say? The power of the voice is potent. Share it in the comments. Get it started. I cannot wait to share all these different things and feelings that are going through my being that are coming out in this form of light. It's a new capacity of energy. If you came for the dunks and you stayed for the energy, there's only more where that came from on a new level. Uh, <laughs> 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 <